So let's go along like that. And maybe we want like... Do we want like a one-way coming off of there? Just to try and alleviate some of the instant pressure? I think that could work. Like just straight up, like out of there. Bam. Because some people might want to come from other places to go to the train station. Although, it means that people come along here, go around there, go up there. Or do you want them to come down, go around here, come in there? Hmm. Yeah. Let's, let's go the other way. I think, man, you, you can just see the kind of like internal workings of my mind. I'm just like, but just baffling myself. Okay, right, so they have to come this way, down, pow. Perfect. That seems like there's a weird level of logic. Maybe? Oh, it's, it's, it's kind of cool. I kind of like it. And then we can have another road come up here. A little bit more. Kill that rock. Sorry, Rocky. Okay, that is a gigantic, ridiculous road system that I'm not 100% certain about. And you can go there. Great. Let's get some industry in here. I hope I hope this does work. Um, please send you know letters of complaint to my office. Um, I assume it didn't get burnt down in the um, the Great Purge of uh, Poolagoon when everyone was kind of going a bit nuts. <laughs> I don't really want industry on that main road. Or there. Or here. Okay, that seems sensible. And these these guys instantly they're gonna have problems. They're gonna they're gonna need like trash. Do you want like a trash trash guy coming off of here? So we can start moving some of the um some of the turds away from the other side of the city. Yeah. Sure, and this, we're going off the uh, the triangle route now, and we'll just kind of come, come like that. Hopefully we can get trash in here. One, and let's have an incinerator too. Two, or maybe another trash thing, why not? You know what? No, 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 no. <laughs> we're getting like, just carried away. So, hopefully, People are going to start moving in here. I'm not really sure how much of a demand there is for the, uh, the super industry. There's a little bit. Okay, some people are, are popping in, which is great. And it means that we can get rid of this. Now, are we just going to lose all the money if we just super burn it in one go? Because at the moment, like, holy shit, oh, I've not really been paying attention to the cash. That is, that is amazing. Okay, let's dezone that area. And we're gonna just try and persuade people to move over. Like we're not we're not kicking them out entirely, we're just relocating them as I think, you know, Poo Lagoon, there's this all all this lovely disgusting land with these horrible mutant trees. Wow, look at these really like Yes, give us young, young mutants. <laughs> like he's get, like the trees are really excited. They've been planning this for a long time. And yeah, industry's kind of like sprouting up. Of course, we forgot to do a bit of power, and the incinerator doesn't have water. So also another thing I learned, man, I've been learning loads of stuff since uh, you guys have been helping me out. What the fuck? What is this? Too few services. Well, you guys are getting kicked out anyway. And we need... We're going to need a fire station for these guys. Uh, can we get it? Like... Oh, by there is really, really good, actually. See, look, they can use the roundabout, and they've got really good coverage. Uh, yeah, so, also, holy shit, 
Who would have thought incinerators produce power? It may, like, you know, there's a certain logic there. Uh, but I had no idea. And, you know, we're teaching each other here. I'm teaching you all about um, some random films every now and again. Like The Village. Or Mutants Are Bad. Uh, and you teach me how to play City Skylines. You know, there's some give and take. Oh shit. Oh no. The power. Oh, I'm getting carried away with shenanigans. Okay, right, let's get... Let's get some power coming down here. You know what? We'll run it on... The Triforce of... Utilities. So we've got trains, roads, and... Power lines. And... Uh, I guess short term. Uh, maybe someone's gonna move in here. It's a race against time. Although, I hear it's gonna need hooking up as well. Shit. Bam. Bam. Great. Ah, ah, look. It's all working. Crisis averted. Now, people coming down here. Are they doing their jobs? That's not even connected. Crisis not averted. There we go. And do we want like a little bit more power in here? We could have more power. Oh well, shit, we want to do like solar stuff. Maybe we should have like solar kind of like, going on on um, Luxury Island. Or maybe we should not get distracted. Too few services, you say? Well, there's plenty of services elsewhere. You guys get out of here. Excellent. Oh man, look, look at all these guys go. Get out. Yeah, kill them all. Oh, what is that? A firehouse. You know what? Do you want to give them double firehouse and it means that we don't need to give any more fire protection to... Pool Lagoon? Or maybe up here. Yeah. I think by there's fine. Because we do have the mega fire station somewhere around there, and they can come down and sort of provide fire protection for those dudes. And also now they're a lot closer. They're a little bit further away than the uh, fire helicopter depot. And right, we are gonna just empty, oh, empty you. Empty you. Empty you. And incinerator, you can stay. Goods unlimited. You're out of here. I don't want any of this, any of your guys' bullshit anymore. Who's this? Coal power plant. He's not really hooked up to anything anymore. I reckon coal power plant is going to come and join these guys too. Right about there. So, oh, I like, I like this kind of like little utility, utility guy. It makes a certain, certain amount of sense. Hmm. Still not 100% here. I wonder if like this middle road didn't actually connect with these side ones. No, that would mean that they can only just change things and get across. Maybe they're like, Extra little little bits that came off. Would that help it? There's a lot of people make these like hardcore right hand turns. I'm sure Timbo knows exactly what he's doing. And I will concede I've got no idea what I'm doing. Literally none. Uh, worst city planner EU. But I'm gonna tweak it just a little bit. Ugh. Oh god. Okay. Not not like that though. That is just the worst. Sure. Close enough. And uh, yeah, we built it the wrong way. Oh well. Okay, we'll test it on this side. We'll see if that kind of works any better. 
know. Traffic lights. Is it just cheating just to turn these off? I'm going to say no. So if that helps out there, then we may do something similar. I don't know, over here. Just have a thing run into the side. Hmm. That looks awkward too. Maybe they just need like a way to get back onto that highway. It'll be okay. So what's the problem? Water. Half these guys, we just didn't give them water. Uh, shit. <laughs> Oops. Okay. Let's ding that into there. Hopefully that will stop them crying for just a little bit. They need workers. Are all of our workers just too educated now? What's the problem around here now? Too few services. You know what I say to that? Get out of here. You guys <laughs> on this like little isolated bit of a uh, bit of nowhere. They were really, really trying to make that work. So we're gonna get these guys all gone. This is an inefficient way to do it. Get out of here, all of you. I don't want any of you left. And maybe this will actually help with some of the traffic on our main road, like that roundabout, which is the hell roundabout. You know what? I think it's time for us to give it a little, uh, this. <laughs> Boop. Oh. Have we lost some districts? Man, shit. Okay, right, so we had to rename everywhere. So we have Hell's Roundabout, which actually is working much, much better. I think pulling all the, um, everything down here, which in turn is now its own clusterfuck, has worked out pretty well. Hmm. Those traffic... traffic guys are definitely causing us issues. So, uh, anyway, we have the Hell Roundabout, which is, um, to be honest, it's not as bad anymore. I don't, I'm not, I'm not too worried. Holy shit, man, look at us. You ignore something long enough and you never have to worry about it. That is, that is perfect. That's my kind of problem solving. <laughs>